Hello boys and girls. Let's look at our NTI activities for today on Monday, May 11th, this very cool morning. So since you have uh, probably need to be inside for a little while, you'll definitely want to uh, catch up on some work and get some of these activities done. I think you'll find that these aren't too difficult. And remember, you always have workbook pages keep you familiar with all the things that we've been doing and get you ready for kindergarten this coming year. Okay, so first of all, as you can see up here, I've already put whose name? K-E-N-Z-I-E. -E. Kinsey. So let's look at the work. I've got Kinsey's name up there. So, um, in this activity, boys and girls, you have three scenes, and here you have some pictures. You know what we typically do here. We're going to cut these out. Before you cut them out, it's a good idea to color them, the colors you want to use. And then you're going to put the pictures where they go in that box. So, for instance, you've got an automobile, or we call it a car. Things that go on the land, in the air, or in the water. So we have land, air, water. The first one is a car. Where would the car go? Okay. Did you say land? Yes. So you would cut that out and put it on this picture. Now, Keep in mind, there's probably one or two for each individual square up above. Now let's go over the pictures that we have. We've got a car. Uh, this is a sailboat. We call it a sailboat because, of course, it has a sail. And we have a jet plane. And what's this? Yes, a bicycle, and this, a rowboat, there's the oars, and the last picture, a helicopter. Okay, so we have pictures of six different ways to be transported, and you're going to put them where they belong. You told us where the automobile or car goes. Let's see if we can find one more to put in place and then you finish it yourself. All right, secondly, um, the sailboat. Where would you put the sailboat? Does it travel by land, by air, or water? Yes, of course, the sailboat is does travel in the water. So you would cut that out and put it here. All right, so I think you can handle those classifying where they belong. Our second page, again, you're going to review our numbers 1 through 10, and we have different uh, modes of transportation by water. Looks like we've got maybe a tugboat, and then a what? We just talked about it, a sailboat, and then back to the tugboat and then the sailboat. I think we've got a pattern going on here, boys and girls. So you're going to put your numbers down, 1 through 10, in order. And of course, the first one, a straight line down, is a 1. So you're going to put them all on the page, and that will be your second activity for the day. Today would be a really good day, boys and girls. For you to um, practice, you know, one of your ABC games that you have in one of your packets. I hope you've been saving those. Uh, today would be also a really good day just to look at the different types of transportation vehicles. Um, as you can see, today we're talking a lot about water sports. I don't know about you, but when it gets a little bit warmer, I am really looking forward to going swimming. So I hope you'll get to do that also. 
Um, so remember, you have workbook pages, you've got your read aloud that I've already posted, and of course, you've got your activities to do here today. So have a good day and get your work done. Take care.